513 right now, it is time to connect the dots. When we make the news, make sense. There's another issue on the horizon for a lot of school-aged kids out there. Going to school unvaccinated. And we're not just talking against COVID-19. Why do medical experts say millions of young lives are now at risk? Let's connect the dots. New research shows the world saw the largest drop in routine child vaccines in the last 30 years. That means millions of kids around the world missed some or all of their vaccinations over the last few years. Experts blame pandemic lockdowns and misinformation campaigns, as well as normal resources being diverted from childhood vaccines to COVID vaccines. Officials had hoped vaccination rates would rebound after the drop in 2020, as health systems would learn to adapt to COVID. But instead, data shows the problem only got worse, especially for vaccinations for measles, polio, and even tetanus. And COVID will still be a factor this fall. The latest data from North Carolina shows under half of kids ages 12 to 17 have one dose of the COVID vaccine. And only 27% of kids ages 5 to 11 have one dose. Right now, health experts say education is the best way to stop this troubling trend. And that is Connecting the Dots.